welcome to Simple Scotch Reviews. Here we have Johnny Walker Gold Label Reserve. It is a 40% ABV blended whiskey by Johnny Walker. By price, I've seen it slightly above the green, so between the green and platinum, probably. But I know it's gone on sale at a lot of places I've seen, so it might be slightly below the green in price now. Let's take a look. There's just not a lot going on in this whiskey. It's light, I get a light smoke. There's a sweetness to it, but I get a light smoke. Maybe you could convince me of some malt, but not a lot going on. On the palate, this whiskey reminds me of the Platinum, Johnny Walker Platinum, the 18 year, just not as good. I get that light earthy smoke, but it's very light. Yeah, I get that earthy smoke, and then there's a sweetness, maybe a cream flavor, like a sweet cream, and smoke. Not getting much else. Wow, really not getting much in this whiskey at all. It's kind of lacking in flavor and in aroma on the nose. But I guess the nose did foreshadow that. That very light, earthy smoke carries into the finish for me. I know when it comes to very lightly smoked whiskey, if some people love the PD whiskey, they, they'll they taste something like a Dalwini and be like, it's not peated. And it's like, it is still peated. It's just very light. And it's, I guess not everyone notices it. Depends on how sensitive you are to the smoke. Um, yeah, this whiskey's just, there's not a lot going on on the uh, nose or the uh, palate. It's like a watered down version of the Platinum, but yeah, just that very hint of smoke lingers, but not, no other flavor lingers, but there's not a ton of flavor on the palate to linger. Um, I guess overall, I would not recommend this whiskey. I'd recommend trying one of these small 200 milliliter bottles of it before you get it, if you're thinking about it, unless you score the uh, 750 on a closer sale, but, or a cheap sale. But unfortunately, yeah, I would not recommend this whiskey. There's just not a lot going on, but I know people that very much enjoy this whiskey. Um, and it kind of took me by surprise when we had it for a few of us and some people really liked it. Um, if you don't like bold flavors, that might be something. And I do like the light whiskeys as well. It's just this one doesn't have a lot going on for me. Um, I wouldn't recommend it at the price point and uh, I recommend trying before you buy it. Thanks for watching.